Hey Aquariuses, it's Sunny, and this is your monthly for the month of March 2016. Hopefully my Aquariuses can have an awesome month. Keep in mind that these are just general readings and I may not talk about your situation and I may not make sense to you in this particular video. Please check out your sun, your moon, and your rising signs for more clarity because certain signs may uh, resonate more with you, so it just depends upon what's going on. What else do I want to say? Oh yeah, if you would like a personal reading with me, please check out the description bar below because my website is always there. This is the second time I've done your reading. So you may find that you aren't able to get stuff done because of distractions or people just wanting your attention or you having to cover for somebody. It's just, no, no, no. Okay, I just had to bring out in the little tune right there because, <laughs> oh my god, it's just, this is crazy. I do have Aquarius in my chart. I do not remember what house. I don't, so I will type it below, I guess, if y'all really give a fuck, but let's see what's going on for you. <laughs> my second spread for you guys and the cards are very similar to the last layout and some of the cards did show up again so that's really, really cool but I do feel that for the month of March this is going to be a really big stepping stone for many of you I know for mid-February you got the theme of acceptance okay and I feel like uh, within mid-February, you were able to start something or there was something new developing, okay? With this new development that happened in mid-February, I do feel that it's given you some sort of strength and some sort of platform and, you know, foundation for yourself. I feel like many of you, like you're networking or, like, or sorry, you've networked because I'm reading for the past, um, You've networked and you've really got your name out there. I feel like this is going to be a really good time for my self-employed, my business-minded uh, Aquarians, okay? So mid-February was really, really good um, for many of you because I do feel that growth um, was really apparent for many of you. Oh, my God. My mommy's calling me and she's an Aquarius. Ain't that funny? Sorry, you guys. Hello? Hey, let me call you back because I'm recording. All right, bye. Okay. All right, so I do feel currently your mindset. I, I'm doing a such a cross reading, but I like to go where spirit guides me. So I feel like your mindset within March... You are making a lot of changes, a lot of improvements. I feel that some of you, you may be going through some legal issues or your mind is on the money and you just, I feel like many of you, like you're learning a new job. There's a sense of a, apprenticeship um, or like you're mastering something. I'm picking up really good energy for like you're stepping up. Like this month, I'm just going to say overall, it's like a stepping stone month. For many of you, for the better, I will say. Um, I feel like, honestly, you must be mindful of patience and timing. But I do feel that um, you guys are on the right track. Um, I feel that, like you should be careful of you overworking yourself and overextending yourself. I do feel like mouths. Maybe something is going on with your car and you're driving more than usual or you're traveling more than usual. But I'm picking up on mouths and just things, just really like traveling and going on, gone. Maybe many of you like maybe you're traveling away, uh, like two or three hours away, or you're moving two or three hours away, or two or three states away. Um, for I'm picking up with the number two, and he is on the second pentacle. But I'm picking up like you're. There's something changing. 
maybe you're getting two jobs or your your uh, income is increasing maybe you're getting a set a second degree but I'm just picking up on change like your mind is on change your mind is on the money your mind um, is on building things okay the foundation for this month you are seriously going to have to continue to work very hard and continue to network yourself i'm not going to lie to you i do feel that you guys are going to have to really stand your ground and make a name for yourself and defend yourself if you can the energy feels very similar to mid-february i will say because you went through this whole give me liberty give me death kind of deal in february so that's really really interesting but um i do feel that like someone is trying to either run on top of you or someone is being really really mean or if there's just confrontation or just training people i feel that you may find yourself having to train someone or doing something over again i'm, I'm picking up on like something isn't right maybe something does not feel right to you during this time um, I do feel that once again you must continue to do what it is that you have to do I feel that if you are in a if you are in a confused place right now this is because a lot is really hitting you at once and it just seems like boom 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 everything is just like all over the place i feel like things are jumbled together and you must put things in its proper place i noticed that a lot of my aquarians you guys are really really neat okay i i don't think i've met a, a messy aquarius i don't think i have and i feel that like you guys really don't do well with clutter and you don't do well with things being out of place so you may notice that things are kind of mitchy match or out of place this month but i feel that you are going to have to be able to like i said to really do what it is you have to do your mindset is trying to work hard your mindset has that i'm ready to get out there and work and do what i gotta do but at the same time you must be mindful of patience okay because the cards are talking about and they are suggesting that you have patience during this time. The challenge that many of you will face. I do feel that you rushing, I'm picking up, it's like you are rushing or you're questioning, you're questioning, if that's, if I'm saying that right, you're questioning, yes, you're questioning, um, like the divine powers or your I feel like you're questioning fate you're questioning karma or you are questioning someone's actions or someone's words it's like you really don't believe somebody I feel that there may be like some trick some trickster energy going on during this time and you are unsure of who to trust you don't know where to go I feel uh, that you must rely on your own gut judgment during this time and understand that actions speak louder than words as well you may have some trouble understanding this 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 came in the challenge position uh once again i do feel like you guys need to give yourself more credit than you do okay i also feel that you must like trademark something watermark something like make sure that this is yours let people know that this is yours okay because you may find that someone is trying to steal your style or someone is like taking something of you that it's like legal issues okay so some of you there may be issues of bankruptcy or not having enough money or maybe you're losing something or maybe you're getting rid of loans or picking up that something is being taken from you that is legal and this may be for better or for or, or for worse i do feel like this is more of a relief like a burden being lifted off your shoulders but as i said these are general readings if if it applies to you take it and just keep it honey if it don't just be like okay sunny that won't for me <laughs> um i keep picking up on divine power 
Also, I feel that you must be mindful of your intuition during this time. You may ignore your intuition. Do not do that. Okay, do not do that. Crowning energy. Beautiful blessings are waiting for many of you. I do see that there's some sort of oh, two aces. Lovely. Um, there's some sort of growth. I feel that many of you, like you want to take better care of yourself. Maybe you're um, trying to eat right. Maybe you're trying to be more healthy. There's, I keep picking up on movement from many of you when things are blossoming and things are beginning and they're growing. Um, many of you, there's some, I'm picking up on some sort of job or either you're working with someone or you're networking. I feel like you are going to gain extra income through another force uh whether this is your partner getting a better job or making more money i just feel like there's a side force that's going to help you with more income i also see that some of you like you're thinking about um spring springtime spring cleaning and stuff like that gardening um, I feel like there's a birth coming in. This may be a physical birth or a birth of something that you worked really, really hard on. Um, with this birth, I do see that it's going to bring... If this is a physical birth, I do feel that it's going to be a blessing in disguise. Um, but it's going to bring in some sort of drama. There may be a birth surrounding um, a Sagittarius or a water sign, Cancer, Pisces, and Scorpio. And this may be their sun or moon and other rising. What's coming in for you in the near future? I'm going to consider this mid-March or early April. Once again, some sort of growth. You have a lot of cards indicating growth and working together, being patient, things coming together. It's, it may be a bit slow, but you're going to get there. So this month is just going to be a, like a big stepping stone. You're going to get there, okay? So never lose faith on, on yourself. I, I do feel that many of you, once again, there's a sense of traveling. There's a sense of networking with a lot of people and truly protecting yourself. I feel like um, you do need to be mindful of who you connect with during this time because everyone really doesn't deserve your time. Really tying into like me talking about like you must copyright something, put your name on it because you may find that people are trying to steal your style or steal something that is yours, okay? And this may turn into a legal issue if it progresses um i do feel that you are gonna have to be able to fight the battle i do see some trust issues when it comes to love you may feel as if your mate is talking to other people or maybe you're talking to other people it just depends upon what's going on but this month is very beautiful for many of you it may seem a bit rocky and kind of weird but i feel like you should just go with the flow really tying into the magician do not fight what the divine God has in store for you because many of you, you may be like, no, this is cool, but I kind of want to do it my way. And karma's going to be like, okay, you you being cute right now, so we're going to let you do you, and we're going to let you fuck up, and we're just going to look at you like, we tried to tell you don't do that. We tried to pull you in this path, but you were like, no, I want to I wanna follow through with this. So don't fight with the divine God, okay? Important messages for my crisis. For the month of March 2016, three cards. Important messages for the places for the month of March. You guys are going to be very victorious and just really have a lot of good fortune and fame if you just control yourself i saw you riding an elephant and this was a very powerful vision this lets me know that with control and discipline you will get there and you will be on top and you will be untouchable you are just really going to have to just understand your inner strength and just really just trust your divine god understand that actions speak louder than words let your work speak for you no i do not want to fucking update to windows 10 because it was complicated okay sorry that was random random pop-up tying into the distractions that i talked about earlier for you guys <laughs>
destiny so yeah many of you like you are destined to be in a certain place at a certain time so do not fight what your divine god and angels have in store for you this is the will of fortune i do feel that your divine god are trying to work with you so y'all be sure fun all right, Triumph. I was really thinking about this card when I saw the um, elephant and you were riding on an elephant. So you guys are going to gain victory. This is the um, chariot. Many of you, like, if you understand discipline and you just, like, let people know, hey, I'm a force to be reckoned with. So, but say it through your actions, not with words, because it may come off a bit harsh if you speak it. Okay. Heart Chakra. I do feel that many of you, like you all, you may gain a connection uh, with someone who you really, really care about. This is going to be a really good time for you. Why are you in here and you know I'm recording? This is going to be a really good time for you to release any burdens that's on your heart during this time. Some of you, like I said earlier, like you may find someone who you really connect with and who you really love and care about during this time. I do feel that your connections with people are going to be more stronger and more, uh, more spiritually and emotionally fulfilling. So I do feel like, you know, like if you are looking for love, you may find it, but just protect yourself during this time. This, this may be a really good month for some of you to find love. You may have a lot of options and you may like narrow people down i feel like you must be concrete and really sure of yourself when you narrow down people and if you do kick them out don't let them come back in just let them know hey i'm not really interested you're a cool person but bye okay um yeah so if you want to date that'd be awesome last card even though this is the fourth uh prosperity begins oh so really big ace of pentacles because this is the second time it's popping up this is the ace of pentacles so there's some sort of growth for many of you and something is blossoming and something is beginning to um things are really turning around for you for the better and it's beautiful it's seriously beautiful card on the bottom oh foundation and achievements many of you you are moving or there's some sort of happy relationship that's coming into the picture. I do feel like you must be mindful of security. And just let stuff go. Because some of you, like, you may be holding on to some things, you know, that you need to deal with. That's been uh, weighing heavily on your heart. Maybe past lovers or you're thinking about past lovers or whatever the case may be. Um, because someone, someone around you really wants to love you. Okay? So just... Hopefully their actions are, you know, telling you, hey, I really love you and I want to be with you. Because many of you, like, you are really, like, someone is really wanting to love you and cherish you. I can feel that energy of someone, like, really caring about you. So that's really, really beautiful. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this message. Good luck with everything. And I will see you in mid-March. Bye.